Hello. Now, I brought everyone over here to show them my new mining base. However, I made an, a mistake when I built this mining base. There's no way I could have known that this was a mistake at the time. Uh, but the problem is that the lander I brought along, this lander here, actually doesn't work. It's not because there's anything wrong with it from my perspective. The problem is that if you switch away from this lander and then you switch back to it, only this engine loads. I think there's a bug in this low profile engine where it doesn't load properly if it's the first thing that loads on your ship, something like that, because it literally is just that engine. There's no debris or anything else. It doesn't matter whether I'm orbiting or parked or it just does not work. So we're going to try and take this lander back to uh, the planet and uh, that is to say our home planet and try to rescue Bob here. The mining base will keep that destroy the ship? It did. I thought it might. That's why I saved. So we're going to land with those intact. Nope. See what I mean? Bob has stopped existing. Of course it can't autosave it and load it. That was the whole problem with it. So... Let's go back to Earth again. Well, we don't have nearly as much air braking in this particular uh, launch, so cross your fingers. That's not going to help any. Nice, gentle splashdown. Perfect. It all works. Recover. All right, Bob, so your mysterious physics-breaking spaceship that vanishes whenever you load the game is no longer an issue. And we got 52 science out of it. But we do need to go back and land... Well, we can't land the lander. We actually need to plant a flag in order to land the lander. The lander doesn't even have its own um, carbonite detection system. So, I guess I'll launch another lander in the next episode.